this out. Very cool. Yeah, that's awesome. Pretty sweet. Crappy tire truck. Really? <laughs> I gotta go return this. Oh, I do? Oh. Yeah. Doing a little shopping at Rona. Come out to that. And there's a nice bike right there. I guess whoever left this on my windshield wiper uh, wanted me to stick it because it's a sticker. I don't really have room on the window itself. A couple are faded away pretty good, eh? So we're going to do it. Hey, buddy. We're just going to do it the, the old fashioned way. Bumper sticker it. It fits down here. Oh, yeah. Hey, Cash, what do you think? That's a good spot for it, eh, buddy? Hey. Well, there we go. She's stuck. Anyway, uh, hopefully whoever left this sticker behind checks out my YouTube channel. I'd like to see who left it on my windshield labor. Anyway, on our little trip we picked up some wood, as Cass is showing you. You want to go up in there, Cash? Let's go check it out. Hey, buddy. Well, anyway, I put my tent up. Uh, we're not planning on going camping anytime soon, but just figured I'd air it out and sweep it out and stuff. Well, hey there, people. Well, it looks like I scored my first uh, yard maintenance uh, grass cutting contract. Um, it's a lady down the street from me, or a couple streets over, actually. I got my shit all loaded up, and uh, let's go cut her grass. So I gave her a price of uh, 40 bucks, front and back here. Yeah, the lilac tree. Grass is pretty friggin' long, man. Wow. Will my mower even go through this? That's some thick shit. Are you serious? How far, how far back do I have to go? Wow. That's a big backyard. I can't get through this. Are you serious? I'll cut her front lawn, see what happens, I guess. That's insane. Well, for the front lawn, I'll be okay with the height of the lawnmower, but the back, I'll probably have to raise it as high as it goes. There's a lot of grass back there. Well, I got the front yard done, and the driveway done. That was pretty thick there. Yeah, I totally underbid this job, that's for sure. My lawnmower, she's not liking it too much. Did a little bit on this side. Yeah, my weed eater, it's not gas, so, and I don't see a plug-in. She's not home. Anyway, we'll figure it out. So I raised it beyond max, as high as it goes. Like it's not even supposed to be there, but holy shit. I'm gonna have to get the, uh, the blade sharpened after this job. Well, at least she has some kind of backyard to play in now. She's got kids and stuff. Anyway, I keep going. Well, I found a way, a uh, new technique, I guess you can call it. It's the wheelie grass cutter. Check this out. Cheers. Oh, 
best beer in a long time. Don't worry, you won't be drinking and driving. I'm sure that one beer is going to be out of my system by the time I'm done this one. I'll sweat that sucker out. What a mess. Well, I run out of gas, so I had to go get some. I got five bucks worth. I burnt probably five dollars worth already. I'm not even half done, so uh, total cost of gas will probably be fifteen dollars, twenty bucks maybe. And she's paying me forty, unless they ask for a bonus, because I wasn't expecting that much grass, man. It's friggin' hay. Well, anyway, I made it to the uh, fire pit over there. I don't know if you guys can see that, it's so far away. Yeah, if I was uh, this person's uh, neighbor, I would have helped her out. Like Everybody's all nice and pretty except for this. I don't know, like I said, I haven't met her, so maybe she doesn't deserve help. But she better pay me my 40 bucks. <laughs> so 40 bucks would make sense if it was a normal line, like normal length. Cut once a week at least. I'm not really complaining, I guess it's good exercise and stuff, but time is money, isn't it? So officially, it's going to be $20 of gas, and I'm not even done. My lawnmower is way over there. I just ran out of gas. So the uh, neighbor on that side brought me a Coke. I needed it badly. Anyway, when I first seen this guy, like I'm like, uh, well, you like the girl that lives here must have pissed you guys off somehow, eh? He's like, no, why? I'm like, well. If she was my neighbor, like I'd help her out and cut her grass, eh? I feel bad, like I feel like a real dick. Anyway, so the bylaw officer was by the other day and they wanted to charge her $120 an hour to send a crew here to cut the grass. And I'm doing it for 40. I'm not whining, I'm not whining. I'm out doing something. My painting job has gone to shit. Nobody wants shit painted, so I'm a grass guy now. I'm just going to finish that little patch. I'll come back tomorrow and finish that big patch. Then I'll cut. See, I'm cutting this grass three times, not just twice, three times. I'll do my wheelie through it. I'll come back, do a high cut. And tomorrow, everything's going to be on the lowest cut possible. I'm almost done for today. I'm going to finish that little landing strip and then come back tomorrow. A man of my words, 40 bucks is 40 bucks, whatever. I said it, I said it. If she wants to give me a tip, well, that's her issue, right? It's up to her. But I'm going to treat it like it's my own yard. Like this is way too high for me. So, like I said, I'm going to give it a third cut. She had a good workout. Anyway, I'm done here for today. So all I got left is that. Then I'm going to lower the mower and do it all over once again. Final time. So I'm going to tell her, like, hire me once a week. I, I, I like, I wouldn't mind doing it if it's like once a week. It's easy peasy, right? But anywho, I got to go uh, thank the neighbors there for the coke. One thing I can say is, like, I'm, I'm going to make a lot of bees happy because of all the pollen I threw around today. This is going to be full of dandelions, guaranteed tomorrow. Guaranteed dandelion city. Good time to make some wine, whoever lives here. Yeah, my little town of Thorsby has dirt roads still. That's how old school it is out here. 51 Street. Well, it's the next day. That's what I got left to do. And I'll lower my lawnmower and redo everything. Everything. I won't be able to do any uh, weed whacking today. I asked her to uh, put an extension cord out the window or something. And it doesn't look like she did. No weed whacker for you. Shoulda, woulda, coulda. I should have finished this last night because today the humidity is crazy. Like way over 30 degrees Celsius easily. Yeah, I did three passes and I'm burnt. That's all tall this guy. Well, I ran out of gas again. I'm 
fill her up and try to get this done at least. I quit after this. I'm not going to do any more. I mean, $20 profit. Yeah, okay. Great. Now it's raining. Like, I really don't want to come back tomorrow just for a little chunk of grass. Stop it. Please stop it. Well, I got her done. Pretty much. I like it to be shorter, but screw it. 20 bucks profit's not worth it, right? It's really coming down big time. And these guys, of course, we city, they were gonna charge this girl $120 an hour to do what I just did in eight hours. So 120 times eight, they would have probably had a crew out here, it would have took them five, six days. So I quit, lady. <coughs> I'm soaked. So next time I do a job like this, I'm gonna have to come and see it before I give my price. <coughs> I just saved her a ton of money, man. Gotta get a bonus. The other thing is, I can't drive home right now. I can't see. I don't have any windshield wipers. I could crawl over to my uh, my buddy Thorsbury Dave. He just lives down the street. Celebrate 420, maybe. I really can't see. Nothing. Oh, my lawnmower is still out there too. I can't leave without that. I put it under my truck so it stays out of the rain. Crank her up. Burr. Ah, got a little action. That'll get me to. The reason I'm going to Thor's Ray Dave's is uh, I'm getting the, the blade and the lawnmower sharpened. So if you really look at this job, <laughs> it's costing me money. That's all good. That's what neighbors are for, I guess. I guess I'm bitching a lot about it, but yeah. Thor's Ray Dave's crazy. He's gonna blow us all up. I don't know. I never tried this shit before. So those are balls from Roman candles. Roman candle balls. And you're spraying what on it? Antifreeze on potassium permanganate. I just keep sitting here. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm scared to stand up back here. Yeah. Could have been My here tonight. Depends on how this... Oh yeah, baby, I like that. I like that. I that's a green one. I got five pounds of this shit. It's, it's a survival for uh, purifying water and stuff, but you can also use it to start fires. Blue. Now I'm blind. I looked right at. It. <laughs> I had magnesium in it because. Oh no. Really bright. So they got welder splash. No, then that's cool. It is cool. Well, I don't think she's gonna pay me. Um, it's been six days. Uh, she's not answering my texts or anything. So I don't. Know. I I paid to cut her lawn, but that's okay. Anyway, people, uh, thanks a lot for watching. Uh, I really do appreciate it. We'll talk to you guys later. Check this out. My neighbor Kiefer brought me a gift. New fire ring. He didn't like my old one for some reason. Anyway, I've got to pull all that out and I'm going to throw the new fire ring in and uh, maybe we'll break it in tonight.